So here we are outside Clemenda's Lead Recreational Center on a very cold morning. It makes you wonder how many people in their right minds would actually come here and get into a swimming pool at eight o'clock in the morning. Well, the answer is plenty. It's about 8.30 here on a Friday morning, and this pool here is jumping. There's about 25 to 30 swimmers here participating in water aerobics classes. It's just one of the many activities offered during the winter by the Clorinda Lead Recreation Center, which is, as you can tell, the next stop on our KMA Winter Fitness Tour. Instructor Linda Armstrong is at the helm of the center's Aqua Splash class. Even on bitterly cold days, Armstrong says there's plenty of reasons why people splash around in the pool. I think uh, just the um, socialization and it, it helps their muscles warm up for the day. And uh, a lot of people like the water rather than the land-based exercising. Lorinda Park and Recreation Director Carson Riedel isn't surprised by the number of people on the pool on winter mornings. 545, we have anywhere from um, usually all six lanes are full of people walking or swimming um, using different exercise devices, whether it be uh, dumbbells, water dumbbells, um, belts and, and kickboards and all those different things. Other patrons like Don Paulson prefer using land amenities like the weight room to stay in shape. Well, if you quit exercising and sit in a chair, you're going to deteriorate fast. Other attractions include the center's cardiovascular room. It's the Leona Rubin Fitness Room, the hub of a variety of exercise classes. And what would a fitness center be without a full-sized gym? And what would a gym be these days without the growing sport of pickleball? From 6 to 96, you can play. You know, it, it's, it, it is good exercise. Um, you know, the, the more into it you get, I think the more you, you push your body to do things in it. Um, but when you're learning, it's pretty easy to just kind of sit back and hit the wiffle ball. Like other area rec centers, Clorinda's facility is experiencing a jump in memberships at the beginning of the year. In fact, the lead center's membership total topped the 600 mark last month. You know, January and February, we usually see our largest spike in, in membership growth. Uh, people get their New Year's resolutions going and they, they decide they want to change their their lives a little bit and lose a little weight or gain some muscle or those sort of things. Um, some people just want a lifestyle change. You know, they start a new diet and they want something to go with it and that may just be walking around the track in the gymnasium. Now, if you want more information about the Clorinda Lead Recreation Center's programming and hours, you can always check their website as well as their Facebook page. And of course, we have links to both of those with the web story at kmaland.com. On the KMA Winter Fitness Tour, I'm Mike Peterson, KMA News.